Hello guys, this is Mugiwara Reviews here and today I'll be reviewing on Get the Oka Hitman Be Born. Now I just want to give you guys a short review, um pretty much because I did a ten minute review and I was kind of pissed off at what actually um because my audio didn't work, which I'm pretty pissed off. A 10 minute review and didn't work. So I'm just going to give you guys a short one. It starts off with Hibari. Uh, it's called um, Betrayal. Uh, it's, uh, uh, it's, uh, I'm reviewing on chapter 324. It starts off with Hibari uh, holding the uh, headband where he stole, where he, when he defeated, um, Ideal, and which is a great glacier lady. And, um, we go ahead and see, um, them get captured by the uh, Vin Vindines, and we actually see the little flashback, which is quite cool. Of the like flashback for um, the Primo and all that. And apparently, um, Shinon was in trouble, and Primo actually wanted to save them, but uh, as you know, it didn't go to plan. And they ha um, they said it, uh, the right hand man, which is the Gakura uh, first, said, "If you go ahead and." Um, help him all the forces of our forces will be destroyed so the first miss guardian which is obviously day on spade which is actually the evil person goes ahead and exp um, says i'll i'll save i'll i, I want to go help them all right and then he does a little smiley face yeah <laughs> like a little evil smiley face and um they get captured and now the end of that and then we go ahead and see uh he buddy no notices uh Julie which is actually day on spade first with um with Chrome like a master like a like an evil master thing and goes oh uh, and, and then it's like whoa whoa why why are you deaf and um and then he explains all the stuff um and then he shows his real self and like holy crap how are you even alive and he goes but do you believe me or not i don't care but the truth is i exist until someone like you could be born sooner yoshi and like oh okay 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 and then it's and then um he actually shows it and he goes and then i i um he explains uh, why he's doing that his plan is actually to overturn the vangola um because um because uh he wants to once there is a threat in Vangola which is um example the Shinon family since back in the day they were really fa infamous and they're really strong just like Vangola and they could have uh, been a threat to Vangola which is why he destroyed the Shinon and he was waiting for the day when the Shimon could come back and destroy the Vangola which is happening right now with a foolish uh so-called foolish tent can tent um candidate which uh, is Suna Yoshi and all that and it's really, it's really, it's really cool. It's just amazing. Um, we go ahead and see that, and uh, what else? What else? What else? Oh yeah. Um, oh, uh, we go ahead and see that, and then, and then, uh, Idol's like, "Where's Julian?" And it goes, "Oh, there's still a little bit of garbage, which is so-called garbage, still inside of me, and all that." And um, he, we go ahead and see. Um, we go ahead and see that, and ideals like crying, getting taken away by the Vindice, Vindice, and unexpectedly we see a, some kind of sword, um, attacking the organs of Day on Spade, and that was the end of the chapter, it was a quite amazing chapter, which is actually, um, which is, um, the guy who, with the sword was actually, um, um, the guy that, uh, injured, um, Yamamoto, the, the guardian for that, for Shinon for that, and he gets really pissed off, and that's the end of that. What I thought about the chapter really quickly, um, it was quite good. Um, um, they, nothing was really unexpected, but we finally learned the real truth of what what happened to Sh uh, Shimon. Um, and I, I still don't know about Bayakuran. Uh, uh, I, I still I still don't know about uh, Bayakuran. Why is he there? He keep. It could be possible that um, he also could. Uh, what do you call it? What you might call it? Uh, uh, Day on Spade could also actually be using illusion organs, just like um, the other person. And Brakuran could somehow somehow Day on Spade manip manipulated the time and actually save Brakuran to be in his side. So even if it's by himself, no way he can defeat them all unless he's like super hardcore strong. So yeah, um, and that's what I thought about the chapter. What I'm looking for next chapter. I'm pretty sure that. Uh, the Shimon and the Gola is actually going to team up and try to defeat him, but I'm pretty sure uh, he could be the mastermind of the whole thing. I honestly don't know, but I'm hoping to see uh, more of Bayakuran and probably see the fight of them. So, 
Um, this is that's my review on Coco Hitman Reborn Chapter 324. Sorry for oh, talking really quick. It's just that I feel really pissed off. I'm doing a 10 minute review and it's been three minutes I think now. Or oh, also, um, I just want to give you guys a little sh shout out. I mean, no, no, a little shout out. If you guys here for the review, you can turn it off now. But I just want to give a little update. Inside the Straw Hat Episode 2 will be coming out most likely about the Kiko Hitman Reborn, about Byakuran and all that. And also, I'm sorry guys for the Bleach review. Uh, I think in the Bleach review, I just never reviewed it. I just told you guys what happened in the chapter and that's about it. Since it was really late and I wanted to finish it off. I did all three all together at the same time. So that's why. Uh, very sorry guys. Um, also, web camp, I'm trying to fix it still. So make sure to stay tuned. I'll be showing my face real soon. <laughs> Hopefully no pedophiles will look at me. I mean, like, like stalk me and all that good stuff. So yeah, we'll do our reviews here. Signing out.